Hello everyone, and uh, this is not exactly what I had planned out for you guys today. <clears throat> so, let me give you a little story since uh, this is secondly not live reported uh, commentary, but rather post commentary. So, today I had plans to uh, give you the Naruto story, the new one, the Shikamaru cell. It recently came out for the season pass users. I believe it comes out on the 15th for those who just want to buy it separately. Now, the thing with that was the fact that my game said it updated, but in truth, it didn't because even when I went to the adventure mode, it didn't bring up Ship Mode's tail. I checked around, looked at the you know, internet, saw a video of someone else doing it, and well, I was like, oh. Okay, so it is a virtual mode that you have to go through, but it'll ask you to switch characters in the process. It didn't ask me to do that, so I... I yeah. <laughs> so, seeing as though today is also the 8th, The Division also came out, and I kind of wanted to record that as well. However, over here on in Buffalo, it just recently came in for me, and this is about 8.34pm, in which I am recording my voice of uh, recording this. So, I have to grind for a bit, and if you can, you can hear my computer, uh, you know, heating up and stuff, and all that good, you know, goodness. So, I'm going to record some footage of that. Hopefully, I can do it without having to use an Elgato, because I'm not having an Elgato yet, and I just use the PlayStation 4's uh, sharing type of thing. So, let's hope that I can actually go through with it. So today, you got some Elzo footage because in my Naruto uh, gameplay, me doing the online matches for Redemption, sad face, I mentioned that I played Elzo, and it's not every day I play Elzo, I mean, it's like every now and then nowadays because, you know, I got all this other stuff to play, Fire Emblem Fates, PS4 games, and all that. Fire Emblem Fates is a lovely game, if you have not played it yet, you need to hurry up and get it, so, be a, ah, I messed it up royally. Fire Emblem Fates is a honorable and great game to play if you do not do not have a 3ds right now you know get you one if you can't afford it then go for a 2ds even though they're ugly and buy it it doesn't matter which version you play though they recommend birthright because birthright is uh easier it's more on the awakening side anyways right now as i talk throughout my first match and pretty much through that match the first match was pretty easy, you know, loose seal and then do all that much. The second match for Valak, I kind of fucked up at the uh, the end when I could have caught him with the uh, my XXX, which you know does that blast. I could catch off of him using my cut tendon or any other active, but I chose not to because I was kind of uh, panicked at the last second. Unfortunately, that's a bad thing about me. Sometimes I PvP, I panic, and Valak ended up taking the win for that. One. So here we have me facing Peninsio, and uh, I believe this one I win. <clears throat> My voice is gonna mess it up, by the way, if you can't hear. But yeah, I think this one I win. I need to get some water, uh, maybe later. You know, like to do a uh, cool little loop. Not really. I don't loop all that much. Just a little easy catch game and all that. I really don't know what to say now that I. Uh, uh, maybe I should actually, you know, go over while I'm recording this so late. Alright, so, throughout all that information I just told you, there was also the uh, issue with converting. Also, this match right here is a good match. I might talk through the whole thing of it, so I just want to lay that out. It's a real good ending to it. Anyways, in terms of converting this video, so I recorded it off of OBS, Open Broadcasting System. You know, the thing that streamers use, because it's easier than XSplit. Uh, you know, easier on your computer not as harsh as I've heard from forums and all that maybe personal people's uh, reviews stuff like that um, I used that and when the video was finished Tekken Wits too because I stopped in between you'll see it I switched to the English voices as well when I uh, do my change that was a felt uh, berserker blade right there anyways when it comes out as the output it came out as a FLV uh, file now, Sony Vegas didn't want to, you know, open up the FOV because that wasn't compatible or something like that. I really don't remember the specifics, but oh well. So, it took me some time to find me a video converter. 
that actually did its job. I ended up going to a YouTube video for it, and it was like one from two, uh, 2012. And that worked. So, finally we converted it, put it over. Now, even with that, that shouldn't be, you know, that shouldn't be the reason as to why it uh, is so late. Did I lose that one? No, I guess I did. Alright, well, anyways, we got another battle. It was one of the fights that I had, I think it was that one, where uh, I wasn't really paying attention. I was turning my chair. This little spinny chair. It's nice. Oh, this one, uh, the streamer 3 match, you lost by <laughs> stupidity. But the next 3v3 match was even worse by stupidity. Anyways, continue on. There's also another reason as why. Uh, a friend of mine, actually that's kind of personal, maybe. Maybe not. A friend of ours, my family, and they have a daughter named Kamora. She's, I think she's like two? I don't know. I really don't remember her age. I'll just my back. She um, came over because my grandma went to church for a uh, choir rehearsal and Bible study. And we usually get the little girl. So we got the little girl and pretty much I play with her. And listen, if you are still growing up, you're a teenager like I am, or young adult technically because I'm 18, um, don't have kids. I know a lot of people say that, you know, don't have kids because they can turn out the worst and you know, it depends on the parenting. I, me personally, I would not have kids. Don't quote me on that because whatever. So going back to the topic of Elsword, uh, Blade Masters, since I'm playing against one technically right now. Blade Master, um, back then when he was first announced, I did have one, he was actually my second class ever made. My first class was uh, Reckless Fist. And I wanted to pick Rec Reckless Fist because, you know, the white, the black and white hair and the giant change of, well, mutated Nazoid arm. I thought it was pretty epic. And then I became a Ruin Slayer main because, well, my friend Leo also had a uh, Ruin Slayer and I would, like, level beside him. It's actually my first friend, too. It's kind of sad. I haven't talked to him in like years now. But yeah, I would love to be beside him. I always, you know, admire the fact that he was a real sword. And I was like, yeah, I kind of want to use that class too. So then I tried out uh, L Sword. And I was like, wow, I like this class a lot. It's a bit faster than Raven in terms of like a um, comboing off of, in my opinion. Uh, you can, you know, challenge me on that. You'll probably be right. But personal preference, uh, I still like to use Raven. But yeah, I became a Ruin Slayer for a bit, and uh, I liked it a lot. You know, started changing around with classes, and mixing them up, experimenting, all that, and uh, come this, uh, whatchamacallit, this revamp of all the characters, I enjoyed Ruin Slayers a lot. I was sad about the fact that they took out my Ice Rune, because I was an Ice Rune guy, not a Fire Rune guy, but I can manage, I suppose. The Blade Master, they just like loved him up the most. Also, this right here, this fight, will prove to you. Don't rush in and be stupid with things because when you have not gotten your gear to 80 and got the right gear that you want, you will get bursted down and you will die in a matter of seconds. Look at my health. It was just at full. I probably should do a zoom in on that, but I kind of already did the editing and I really want to get to playing the division, so just everything's kind of half ass compared to. Naruto's, but as decent. Um, but yeah, as you can see from my health, it just dropped down completely and went to absolute zero. And, well. That was not how exactly I wanted to, you know, start this match off. It was kind of terrible when I was doing the match. I was like, what the fuck just happened? But yeah, my just gone completely. Just out of here. What health? What are you talking about? Didn't exist at all. I learned that an ad, an Elsis, and a Dreadlord going into a bar is like the worst thing that possibly happen to you. And if that happens to you at all, consider yourself lucky if you end up coming out the match the victor. 
yeah, I kind of got into both. So I honestly don't know where I just left off at, but I'll start with something else. But yeah, with the revamps, they gave Plate Master a hell of a lot more, like, you know, combos, versatility, and made them all around great and all that, and we just lost the match. This is the last match coming up uh, right here. So, oh, as you can see from the Black and her right here, Veteran Blood Demon. I don't like fighting either one of them, especially Veteran Blood Demon because she comes up almost every single time, which is the reason why I got her title. I was doing 3v3 with so my Guild Master, well, former Guild Master, Nemo, and my best friend Strat. And, you know, it's pretty fun. Ended up running to her a couple times and I ended up getting a title from her. So, hey, that's pretty nice, you know, to have. But uh, this video is actually coming to a close. I'm looking at the timeline for it, and uh, it'll end in a few seconds. So, I might as well do a quick outro right here. Um, thank you guys for watching and so on and so forth. I will have The Division or Ellsworth, uh, Naruto, I mean, posted up in a few days or something like that. So, I hope you watch it. Alright, take care.